can see the gate valve type GBC. They have a Jotun coated ductile iron body and a resilient coated rubber ductile iron seat. The trim inside here including the shaft and the nuts and bolts underneath are all stainless steel. There is a, if we have a look over here you can see all the retaining nuts are sealed with silicon including the one on the top, I don't know if you can actually see that yet. I'll just shift it back a little bit. And there is a seal. If I just turn this around, maybe we can just focus on that. Seal just inside here on the shaft. Got that? The seal on the shaft inside here. The stainless steel shaft. They're very easy valve to operate and they're designed for water and wastewater applications. Uh, the coating goes right through the valve and there's a the gate, ductile iron resilient seated gate, the gate is coated in, in the rubber. It goes up and down inside this housing in here and the whole housing is completely isolated so that the gate is, is uh, isolated from the outside media. Uh, if I just operate this, just take, turn it down, it's very easy to to spin, very smooth action, and the whole unit goes down to the bottom as such. The unit comes also has an option of having this little uh, key device which goes on the top and you can remove the hand wheel and this pops it over as a key cap, it goes over the top of the shaft and bolts back down again so that people can't fiddle around and operate the shaft and the valve once it's been operated. Now there's a legend plate on here. These valves can come with various options. They can be watermark. And the flanging inside there is uh, done to the AS4087 standard, PN16, which also interfaces with table D, table E. The whole valve is made in accordance with AS 2638.2 and it's an ideal unit for any outside application for controlling this a wide variety of